This is question 20 from the 2008 calculator paper. Here we're told that q is inversely proportional to the square of t. When t equals 4, q equals 8.5. Find a formula for q in terms of t. So the first thing that I need to do is I need to say, well, q is inversely proportional to the square of t. So what I'm going to say is that q is equal to k over t squared. So we know that they're inversely proportional, but we don't know exactly how they're inversely proportional. Now what I'm then going to do is I'm going to substitute these two values into this formula to find out the value of k. That will give me a formula for q in terms of t. So by substituting in here, I get q is equal to 8.5. And that is equal to k divided by t squared. So t is 4, so k over 16. Now to figure out what k is equal to, I just am going to solve this equation. k divided by 16 equals 8.5. So k is equal to k is equal to 8.5 times by 16. And so that is going to give me an answer of um, should be able to work this out in my head, but Let's just use the calculator. 8.5 times 16, that gives us an answer of 136. So k is equal to 136. So what I could say then is that my formula for q is going to be q equals 136 divided by t squared. Part b asks us to calculate the value of q when t equals 5. Well, now all we're going to have to do is use our formula that we've just used that we've just found out and say that q is equal to 136 divided by t squared divided by 5 squared and so that means that q is equal to 136 divided by 25 and so again using the calculator 136 divided by 25 q is equal to 5.44 Now if you didn't quite get that right, what I suggest you do is you pause the video at this point and have a go at this question here. Then press play to see the answers. So y is inversely proportional to x squared, given that y equals 5 when x equals 2, find the value of y when x equals 10. So same idea here is I'm going to say that y is equal to k over x squared. Then I'm simply going to substitute these values in, so I know that 0.5 is equal to k over 2 squared so that means that 0.5 is equal to k over 4 which means then that k is equal to 4 times 0.5 which is 2 so k is equal to 2 so I've got a formula now for this um, relationship of that's inversely proportional, and I can say that y is equal to k uh, is equal to 2 over x squared. I figured out what k is equal to. Now it asks me to find out the value of y when x equals 10. So y is equal to 2 divided by x is 10, 10 squared. So y is equal to 2 over 100. And so what we could say then is y is equal to 2 divided by 100, 0 0.05.